so I just got back from the orientations on October 4, uh, the first orientation day in fall 2021. And after picking up the books and supplies, I was just so surprised at how huge it is for all these books and also um, attend a long day for you know, welcomings and also different student activities. I uh, also get lunch, met some new friends, and that's the most exciting part. Exciting part. And also, right now, I'm about to show you guys what did I got for um, my bags of books and supplies. So first of all, it's a big box. Um, I don't know what's in here. Maybe some maybe some tools and stuff in here. open so this is how the box look like i thought i'm still the electric so engineering or something but i think pretty much we will use this along uh, with our school stuff and also on the top it's look like this but we'll see how we use it along the semester also let me show you this big ass um, oh my gosh, I can't, ta-da, oh my god, messy background, but also I got my uh, student ID right here, really cute, and, oh my gosh. this huge bag right here with all these books, and let's see what's inside, oh my gosh, first one, for textile science and they have two books in here and all these tape and um, needle tool so this is really convenient that uh, the first time I experienced this ever because usually we have to purchase the books by ourselves but here they provide it because I think it's included in the tuition fees so the first one is private science and it's like really thick and then also sweat reference guide for fashion fabrics ah cool 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 i'm so thick what's in here i think just different fabrics i guess all right i'm gonna put it back together later in here digital ebook information so one of them will be have an ebook and the rest will be um the actual one. Oh my god oh, this is so big so this one is for technical sketching one, um, pretty much. Hold on. So this is technical sketching one, faction flats and technical drawing. And let's open this. Wow, this is really a lot. Okay, the second class is just a huge bag of all the supplies and books right here from um, the technical sketching one. So they have two classes with this. Uh, the first one is fashion flats and uh, technical drawing. Oh my gosh, I'm really bad with drawing. I don't know what's in here. <laughs> but second is the tracing, tracing paper. Ooh, oh, I know this. So it's different type of paper that you actually can see through. It's really thin. Uh, it's called tracing paper, smooth surface, 50 sheets. Never see this, never. I'm just not good at drawing, guys. Um, also this one, the kits. Wow, this is something else. Okay. Ooh. It's a long list. 
Okay, we have that mesh white. This one right here. And two of the ruler metric six inches. I think these are ruler metric. And then um, French curve sets three pack. Mars plastic eraser. Why? Oh, it's like a whole list for this back. Okay, got it. Um, we have Mars plastic eraser whites right here, I believe. Let's see. I guess so. And then also flexible ruler and some um, something. Let's see. Oh, it's not stick on your skin. Then we have three of these. Uh, let's see, what is this? Michael Pigment ink for waterproof and fade proof light lights. Wow, well, really specific. All black. And then <laughs> this is eraser. This two and some pencil. Wow. All right, let's move on. Really thick. Oh my gosh. We have a lot of trading, but this is uh, just. My apologize to pronounce it wrong, but it's called tracing, and it is a semi transparent paper you can use to trace an image or drawing. Once you trace an image onto a tracing paper, you can easily transfer it into another piece of paper or even a canvas different size, I guess. A lot of training. All right, next, we have layout bone. So bone paper is a high quality, durable writing paper similar to bank paper, but having a weight greater than 50 milligram. Also, for this, it's not see-through and it's thicker than the tracing paper. Lay up on paper. Please don't let me draw. <gasps> Sorry, bro. Let me see flip through. So we actually have two of this. Lay out one, so thick. So that's the, everything we have for technical sketching. <laughs> I think this is worth your money. Um, we have another ruler and another one in different shape. I don't know how you call this. Very fun curve rule. And then this is graph ruler. <laughs> this is crazy. <gasps> yeah, I have a huge bag. Oh my god, so freaking heavy. And this is the last one in, in here. Also, this bag by itself, I went to the bookstore earlier and asked them this costs around $62 if you buy it, but uh, when they send you the books and supplies sheets, after you're filling out your register classes, and um, you can actually have three options to choose the bags. So I actually chose this, the biggest one. They have um, the, what is that called? The wheel, so we can kind of like 
drag it like a suitcase, you know, so it's convenient instead of carrying because all these stuff is just super heavy. And I also bought this extra bags as well at the bookstore and this cost $39. It's really cute design, uh, especially right here. So it makes it really stand out and just I just like it so much. And then also they sent us some free bags in here that I got this morning. And yeah. But we have French European, French European dress making sheer. I think it's just the Caesar shears. But they make it so fancy. Alright, next. This one is the Stana Stable. 500. 5,000. 5,000 stable. Wow, that's a lot. What is this? Stable remover. Oh, okay. Stable remover. Well, I don't need to buy anything. They already provide everything for us. Because when you actually go buy it, you have to look it up. And then, I, for me, I don't know these terminology. And it might take longer time for me to just like go search at Target or Walmart. Oh wow. <coughs> what are these? What is this? So big. Oh my gosh. And it's super heavy too. Why it looks so dirty? A little bit oily. But like Seriously, why so dirty? Did they... Is it new or used? Okay. Another pencil. And um, a red something. And we have the stapler here. That they provided for us. I'm not sure it's like after school student can return to get money or something, but the box looked like somebody already used it. Or it's been smashed up in the back. Another tape. Another box with all these. Oh my gosh. Wow. This is really detailed. Um, I'm not going to open this because there's so many in here. But they have the pattern notcher, French curve, wide thread, loop turner, needle points, tracing wheel, flat head, screw driver, wide zipper, um, inside ziplock bag. Like a bunch of different stuff in here. What is this? paper that you use to in order to cut or do something. Oh, I'm getting scared. I really suck with cutting and drawing. Like I said, I'm not anxiety. Back in um, first grade or sixth grade, I have to do this and I always ask a friend to draw for me or do something that I'm not good at. All right, it's another one that they provided for a marker cutting instructions for the class MFTG for 1400s. Um, I forgot the, what is this book? Let me this class about. Oh, I think it's the apparel, apparel process one. So yeah, this is a parallel productions. Um, this book with the studio here and access card for online I think next one we have faction sewing pretty cool so if you think like only fashion designer have to do all of this I think um, when my um, directors cheer I mean 
major director she mentioned that we all need to do this in order to learn and know how to do it so management you also need what's going on also this book is big This is part of making for fashion design. <gasps> Come on, I'm not fashion design <laughs> student. <coughs> but that's pretty much for uh, what I have in this big ass um, carry bag right here for school. And this Wednesday, I'm gonna have, I believe it's uh, the class. And I'm not sure it's in person or remote, but I'm just so excited to learn something new. And we'll update with you more information um, on the orientations tomorrow. Well, thank you so much for watching what I have in my schools and supplies books.